As hotels begin to fill up, or as we just saw, downtown Jacksonville under their own evacuation orders, many local families are opening up their homes to evacuees. That includes members of the Action News Jacks family, where they've had members of their family have to evacuate from Miami. Action News Jacks Lorena Inclan shows us how local homes are becoming much needed refuge. As Irma approaches, many local families are opening up their homes to evacuees. Many of my own family members live in Miami, and some of them got to my house early this morning, turning many Jacksonville homes into safe haven for people and pets looking for shelter. For me, it was more like the baby and the losing power. That was my cousin David Ramirez's motivation for evacuating from his home in southern Miami-Dade County and heading north. It was supposed to be like a five hour trip, it turned into like a 10 hour trip. After the long road trip, a lot of people are like sleeping on the rest areas. Like, I saw a lot of accidents. He finally made it with his baby boy Luca, wife, in laws, mom, and brother. And the dogs. You can't forget about the dogs. And their three dogs, who wasted no time playing with the two I already have. Inflatable mattresses cover nearly every inch of our floors as hurricane supplies stand by. This is just one example of what many local homes look like. This will be the norm for the next few days. And for those in need, a safe shelter is priceless. I think if you were able to get out, that was the right choice to do. Like, that was the right move. Lorena Inclan, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.